In this tour of the Harness IDP, Internal Developer Portal, we'll be looking at three core capabilities. First, a software catalog. Next, scorecards. And finally, self-service workflows. Let's start with the catalog. The catalog brings together key information, including documentation, views into DevOps tooling, and dependencies into a single portal so that a developer working on a service, such as this boutique front end, has at their fingertips everything they need to get their job done. They can quickly view their development documentation, see what's going on with their DevOps tooling, such as CI, CD pipelines, access their APIs, and view their dependencies. I like viewing this dependency graph where I can easily see that my boutique front end service is part of the platform demo system. On the right, I can see all of the other components and services that my front end depends on. We also have access to the scorecard we were talking about earlier. With a scorecard, we can establish key criteria and measure each of our services and teams against that criteria, such as do we have a high success rate for our APIs? Are we on the latest libraries? And do our developers respond to pull requests quickly? Each of these can be checked. We can measure our performance over time and come up with a total score. Finally, I'd like to dive into the self-service flows. With the self-service hub, platform engineering teams can build out services, workflows, automations that are available to the developers to execute. This can be something as simple as getting access to a key resource, or it can be building out a whole new service, establishing the core scaffolding and the DevOps pipeline. To do that, all I have to do is fill out a couple of key details, and then automation is executed that will set up my service. This automation is defined by the platform engineers. An example here creates a repository, brings in our standard boilerplate scaffolding into that repository, establishes our build and deployment pipelines, and even deploys out to the early environments. The administration of this tool is completed entirely through this web interface. Here, in order to add a plugin, manage a plugin, you'll do so through this experience. Similarly, if you want to change the layout of your portal or the rules behind your scorecards, you do that all through the administrative interface. I hope this tour of the Harness IDP has been valuable for you. Thank you.